day to viewers, the Colonel speaking to you live from the Grange, British Imperial YouTube Broadcasting. Now we've got something very peculiar for you here today. Columbia L06, March On, Song of the Blue Shirts, forward by Commander O. Locker Lampson, CMG DSO MP, and sung by Harold Williams. Words by, as you can see stamped there, words by Commander Locker Lampson. Very peculiar family. Look him up on Wikipedia, you will find that, uh, well, a very, very odd chap. In fact, if I sit down in the Colonel's chair, um, I'll tell you a little bit about him. Let's have a look. Oliver Locker Lamps, and that's the fellow. Yes, he founded. Um, where is it? Uh, yes, he founded the <laughs> the Sentinels of Empire, and this is their marching song. It's rather an amusing sort of footnote that. Um, they lived not far from um, the Sitwells, and Sir George Sitwell, who lived on one side of the valley, and the Locker Lampsons lived on the other, and in the middle was a huge industrial complex, and uh, Sir George Sitwell once said to Evelyn Moore, um, you know, there's absolutely no one between us and the Locker Lampsons. Right, here we go, viewers. Many have long felt the need of tapping the fund of latent loyalty in human hearts by founding an order of independent patriots to foster faith in the future of our destiny and to encourage self-sacrifice in the service of liberty and order. The result has been the starting of the Blue Shirts and the launching of their fighting song, March On. What was most wanted was to inspire followers and to focus their emotions with a tune which could be recognized everywhere sung at meetings, and even hummed over at home or at work. The motto of the movement is Fear God, Fear Naught, and it is hoped that March On will lend itself to many a crusade in the cause of these ideals. although I don't suppose it's sung at many workplaces these days. Blue Shirts were a sort of patriotic British organisation, uh, sort of uh, a bit like the Empire Party or round this way, the Duke of Bedford's British Empire Party. I thought old Oliver Locker Lampson sounded suspiciously like Vivian Foster, the, of, uh, the, the vicar of mirth. Dear, oh dear. Thank you viewers and goodbye. <laughs>